It's always very satisfying when a plan comes together. That's the case for Dayton Christian. Five years ago, the school hired former Bengal lineman Ken Moyer, and he's a guy that you want to play for. Last year, the Warriors played pretty well indeed, producing a 9-1 record see, with a playoff appearance. Dayton Christian has to fit some different pieces into the puzzle here in 2018. That's because the team lost five Division VI All-State players to graduation. The Warriors are young, but do return some experienced, skilled players. The Warriors will open the season against their rivals from the north, Troy Christian. Dayton Christian, a program on the rise and sure to be a favorite to claim the Miami Valley Conference's gray division. It's fun. You know, we had three guys that went off and played college football last year. And uh, um, we had a fourth guy that will walk on next year more than likely. So we talk about the way of the Warrior. We want them to grow um, in the ways of the Warrior, which are things that will make them not only good football players, but better men. We're uh, creating a buzz a little bit. But, uh, hey, you know, every Friday you got to go out and play. The buzz doesn't mean anything. It's how well we play. Uh, our team this year, I mean, we don't run on one or two guys. Um, we play as a team, and everybody has a role, and they, they do it really well. A lot more ground and pound type of team. We're going to be running the ball a lot, being more physical brand of football but uh, I like that with the guys we have we have good size we our depth is a little less than we had last year but I'm confident we've been working our stay in shape and we're ready to bring it this season